this rocket, which was launched on September the 24th, uh, and the image was taken from Orlando, Florida, uh, which is about 50 miles away, uh, contains three probes. The interstellar mapping and acceleration probe, which is uh, going to be sent to Lagrange 1 with the other two probes to... Uh, this probe will have uh, ten instruments on it to measure... Uh, the solar wind and how the particle um, and try to study how the particles are accelerated. Uh, it's also this is and the magnetic fields are in the area. This is to help study the heliosphere, which is a area around the sun that extends out past Pluto. And this is a kind of a bubble where the solar winds kind of push back all the other material coming in from the galaxy. Uh, there's also the Carruthers uh, Geo Geo Corona. Observatory, which is going to ex explore the exosphere, uh, which is a outer layer of the atmosphere, and see how this changes dens like size, density, shape over a period of time, and uh, how other factors, how uh, certain factors uh, affect it. And then, then there's the space weather follow-on Lagrange One probe sent by NOAA, the National uh, Ocean and At Atmospheric Administration. And this is to uh, study space weather. This is one of the first probes to just study space weather, and to make sure uh, to measure things like coronal mass ejections, and to get a more accurate measure of space weather. Okay, I hope everybody has a good day and goodbye.